<laughs> What's up, everybody? It's your boy, Mr. Duga, coming at y'all with another episode of Dropping Dimes, Mr. Duga. And tonight, I'm going to talk about tonight's Sunday night baseball matchup as you had the Atlanta Braves losing to the San Diego Padres 10 to 2 and have lost three straight and three out of four to the Padres after such a promising start to the series with the RC walk-off. Um, before I get into this video, for everyone, if you want to give me a follow on my social media platforms, I'm going to have all that information down in the description box. May not always get a chance to respond to questions and comments on these videos, so feel free to DM me. Whenever I get a chance to, I'll get back at you. Come highlight at your boy. Also, if you're a Madden player on Xbox One, I'll have my Xbox One gamer tag in the description box also yeah man Braves fall to the Padres 10 to 2 tonight just a real ugly game man died after a nice outing his last start got lit up tonight pretty good man the uh, old man Nelson Cruz um turned back the clock 42 years old don't matter he got six RBIs tonight uh and you know they kept hitting home runs like golf balls off the ground and stuff. It just went not back, man. Um, you know, the pitching staff is a little, little bit of disarray right now with the injuries, you know. Um, Strider didn't look quite itself the last outing. Freed is banged up. Kyle Wright is banged up. You know, we we limited in the, in the rotation right now. But to me, honestly, even more disappointing than that has been the offense the last couple of nights, man. Um... You know, I know we're missing Michael Harris, um, and Hilliard is 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 not Michael Harris. I mean, with all due respect to him, you know, uh, shout out to him for getting on this level, but he, he's not Michael Harris, especially um, offensively. Um, you know, but our, our top guys are doing well. Acuna, you know, Olsen and Riley are doing well. Everybody else kind of, you know, has just really not gotten it done lately. Um had, had men on base tonight, but overall just didn't play well. Uh, three straight losses. Look, the Padres are a good team. Padres are a very loaded, talented team. This team was in the NLCS last year. Um, so, you know, they got a lot. of They got DeSoto, Machado. You know, at some point they'll even have Tatis back. I mean, they did a real deal. You know, they got a real shot to win this NL West this year. Like I said, I don't think the Dodgers are as strong as they were in the last couple of years. So, um, but, you know, still it's disappointing to lose three straight to them at home, yo. Um, especially starting the season the way we did. Um, you know, then going to St. Louis and sweeping the Cardinals and then coming back, winning the first one in walk-off fashion. And, you know, you'll be okay with a split. You know, 2-2 two -two against a powerhouse like that, you know, you're okay with a split. But, you know, to lose three straight, it's a little disappointing. Um, got the Cincinnati Reds coming in. They just coming in off of playing well in Philly. So, um, you know, we got to gotta turn it around quickly. Obviously, it's, look, it's extremely early in the season, man. I mean, we still got well over 100-something games left on the season. So, and usually we're a team that normally get hot later in the year anyway. This is actually the best start to the season we've had in a while. You know, we usually start off really slow and then, pick it up during the summertime. So, um, you know, it's kind of early to be looking at the standards and all that. But, you know, you still want to see your team play good baseball. And that's the thing with these long seasons like that. You have your moments where you feel really good and your moments where you're a little down. Like um, a few days ago, especially Thursday night, I'm like, man, this team is just ready to make some noise. And today I'm just like, boy, here we go. But, you know, shout out to the Padres getting it done. But, um... You know, got the Cincinnati Reds coming in tomorrow night. You know, um, no days off, basically. But, you know, the bats, I feel like, are going to be all right. We got two much good hitters in this lineup for the offense to continue to be stagnant the way that it's been stagnant. But for me, I am a little concerned about the health of this pitching rotation. You know, um, I need our big dogs back out there, and I need them back out there pitching at the level I know they can pitch at. Um, but with that being said, that's all I got for y'all tonight. Appreciate y'all checking out the video. Hit the like button for your boy. Give me a subscribe. I'm going to have Atlanta Braves, MLB, and content on my other teams throughout the year.
Y'all have a blessed one. Go Braves.